to save you a huge speech about my love for fall clothes, I'll just keep it short. <sighs> fall fashion just gives me like a triple, quadruple shot of serotonin every single time. So I'm excited to get into these outfits. Princess Polly partnered up with me for this video and gave me a discount code for you guys, which is RR20 to get 20% off. Before we get into it, I want to let you know that Princess Polly ships from within the United States and they have free express shipping, which is three to four days to the US on orders over $50 USD. They also offer afterpay to all US customers, so go knock yourself out. They have some really cute stuff. All right, so let me show you some trendy outfits. I'm so guilty of being obsessed with this school uniform-esque kind of outfit that's been floating around the internet. This crew neck is actually really light and easy to layer with. Fun fact, I'm actually from Brooklyn, New York. I didn't always live in Miss Florida. Anyways, this skirt is single-handedly letting me live out my trendy girl dreams, so I have no complaints. This is such a good fit for when you want to be comfy because it's so easy to do with only a tiny bit of effort. I got a collared shirt to layer underneath so the collar would stick out, but I accidentally got an oversized one, so I'm gonna cut it to make it work for me by removing the sleeves and the bottom half in a rounded shape and boom I'll have a layered collared shirt look without the sweat soon enough but for now I think this look without the collar poking out is just as cute I think we've established in like every video I've ever made that brown is one of my top favorite colors so this outfit really does it for me I love that this dress is super comfy and non-constricting. It has these adjustable ties so you can pick how short or long you want the dress to be. I decided to go with a pair of the cutest shoes ever. They're like platform, sandal, heel, boot shoes? Question mark. Whatever they are, I love them and they're perfect for Florida when committing to boots is just too much. I just added a simple blazer and a black purse and called it a day. Super easy to wear but still feels really put together. I love it. Blazers and brown tones are super popular right now so... I feel like this checks all the boxes. Also, if you're looking for a staple bag, then this black purse will definitely do the job. Matching loungewear sets. I have no other words other than yes. This is the ultimate kind of loungewear outfit for when you want to be cozy, but maybe you have to go to the grocery store or something too. I love that this set comes with a cardigan because as much as I love and accept my body, I literally overeat every day of my life and sometimes I would like my little belly pouch to have some coverage, okay? It's just personal preference to make me feel comfy. I also thought this little phone case was the perfect match for this light and cozy outfit. I love those people who have a phone case to match most of their outfits. Very iconic of them. Also, I spend half of my life in PJs, so this fit makes me feel like I have my life together while still satisfying the PJ preference. I made a goal to add more things out of my comfort zone into my wardrobe Hence why this blue dress with purple lace trim has entered my life. It's super cute, but has a little funky element, which I love. I decided to pair it with a classic black fall blazer. I personally always feel extra confident in bigger clothing, so this is kind of being my security blanket. To make this a bit more seamless and casual, I'm adding these black boots that are super easy to walk in and make me feel like I can stomp on absolutely anyone. And there you have it. I love that all of the black pieces in this outfit have a different texture and it makes the vibrant dress feel less scary to wear. So, I layered this white dress that has a fitted button-up kind of vibe with a white corset to flatter my body, and I love this combo so much. Monochrome outfits make me unnecessarily happy, and I love to use colorful accessories to spice it up. Green feels like the color of the year. So many people have been slowly gravitating towards it, and if you're like me, you have a mild obsession with it at this point. I also love kitten heels because they're so cute and easy to walk in, like a flip-flop heel hybrid to me. This outfit is so simple but really stylized and I love playing with textures to make outfits feel more unique especially when you're using a lot of the same color. Another loungewear set. I put it on my to-do list to get more matching loungewear because working from home and living life during a pandemic means a lot of PJs so I want to make myself feel more put together on a daily basis without having to wear quote-unquote real clothes. The muted green color is also a plus for me. 10 out of 10. My favorite casual cool girl trend is a giant oversized zip up, a tiny top, and jeans. Where I live, it's super hot all the time, so I really like that this sweater is nice and thin, and it's my first time having any clothing that has a waffle texture, and I like it. It's very soft, and the color of this is also really easy to style. I originally picked out a big old baggy pair of jeans, but they ended up being sold out, and Princess Polly surprised me with a random pair. I appreciate the funky pockets, and they aren't skinny jeans, so I'd say they did 
did a pretty good job. Oh my goodness, I was so excited for this one. I've seen this watercolor pattern fabric all over Pinterest and on models, and when I saw this on the site, I felt so lucky. It's a really soft and breathable tank, and I like the cut and the texture. It's simple but stylish and really easy to wear. I barely have long sleeves for my summer and spring wardrobe, but we all need at least one for fall. I like this one because of the adjustable ribbons on the side that make the top look more fitted and detailed. I really like when simple tops and pieces have really nice little details to make them a little bit more unique. These next few months are when people wear outerwear the most, so I decided to get a cute little cardigan that I can layer with a lot of different outfits. Usually I gravitate towards white, tan, or black cardigans, but I'm trying to challenge myself to make new combos. I'm usually not the biggest fan of knit, but I think that this cardigan does it so well with the smaller stitching and the perfect oversizedness. Next is this basic crew neck sweatshirt in this blue color. It's definitely growing on me. It's not something I would normally get, but I can definitely see myself wearing this with like baggier jeans and a cute purse. This is comfy. I know. Saving this crop turtleneck for a really chilly day when neck protection is needed. You can't go wrong with tan in fall. Lastly, I had a vision for this top that could be tied in I'm sure a bunch of different ways. I think this would be so cute with some like brown leather pants and some nice like squared off boot heels. I think it could be a look. I'll keep you updated. Whew. Trying on clothes will always be like the most intense workout for me i hope you got some fall outfit inspo i'll have everything linked down below and don't forget you can use my code rr20 for 20 percent off on the princess polly website thank you again to princess polly for sponsoring this video <laughs> don't forget to subscribe and follow me on my other socials go ahead and stock me on those because why not sending you guys lots of love and good energy and i'll see you in the next one bye